Hi everyone. In this short video, I'm going to talk to you about closing your account or putting your account on hold for holiday mood. So if you're going on a vacation or if you if you're thinking of shutting your account for a a few months I'd like to talk to you about this and what has happened to me recently I used to have 70 80 almost 100 about 100 listings sometimes and recently what I did I decided just to shut the account because I was going away for a bit and at the same time, I was wondering, because here in the UK, if you have a, just a normal eBay shop, you will be paying something like 20, about £30 per month on your subscription of your eBay store. So because I didn't have much listing, I decided I'm going to put the account on hold and afterwards for a couple of months then i'll come back and rethink about it and restructure it so what i did is shut the account down kept it for a few months then came back and i thought about why am i paying 30 quid and i don't have much listing so i loaded up only a couple of lists here we are. So at present time, I have about 19 listings. And I used to sell all sorts of stuff. So I decided I'm going to do a, a slight niche and concentrate on just, just trainers. But now after just about a month and a half, I'm in almost end of May 2019, I'm... I'm realizing that this, this is a big mistake for me to shut the shop because eBay, they're not promoting my list as well as I want them to. So for example, this is all my listings. Even though I'm, I'm heavily promoting the listings, but it seems I haven't yet to sold any, I only sold one pair of trainers, which is quite annoying, because although I'm promoting them, as you can see them, I'm promoting this stuff, as they want me to promote, so here we are, I'm promoting them, what they say they're promoting, and I'm coming to a conclusion where eBay are not promoting those listings as well as they should. Because at that time I have about seven watches and yeah, about 19 pairs of trainers. And obviously none of them are selling. So if we look, go back to our performance summary and have a look, I mean, I'm getting a bit of traffic, as you can see, all right, there we are, it's getting good impression, 30,000, uh, 30, click through, raise zero point, and look, obviously it's very disappointing, so I'm just one, wondering, is anybody else saying the same thing as I'm saying, because I'm not a, a new Sell. I've been selling for a while, and as you can see, my feedback is not, you know, you don't get that kind of feedback overnight, do you? So I think selling for a couple of years, you know, I have this account for about 2000, since 2005. So you can imagine how long I've, I've been selling. So I'm just wondering, 
And also, is anybody out there wondering the same as I'm wondering? Is What is happening? Are the eBay are promoting my listing or they're just not doing their job properly? Or am I doing something wrong? I'd like to get some feedback from you guys out there. And if I make a mistake, if I did, is it because I've choose, chosen to go just one single niche rather than selling bits and pieces as I used to? So I look forward to your, for your comments down below. And um, so is it because I've changed, I'm not paying eBay the subscription? You know, the monthly subscription, is that the case? So this video may seem to be a kind of a rant but I'm sure I'll get back. I'm sure I'm going to start putting some more listing on. And obviously, I'm going to try as a private seller for a while, see what happens. And later on, I will come back and um, need be, I'll open up a eBay shop again. So, I mean, as you can see, I only sold. I only sold. Have I sold anything? Last ninety days. Let's have a look. I have hardly sold anything in the last ninety days. Oh, there's only one order. There we are. Um, yeah, I've just sold a a trainer there. So. That was quite good. But then you may be asking if you're not selling, if you're not taking it seriously, why, do, why are you bothering with eBay? Uh, luckily, I do have other jobs. So uh, in that sense, I'm okay. But just to show you guys and guys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, that eBay wants you, if you're a, if you have a shop in eBay, they want you to have a shop in eBay and pay them all this good money. It doesn't matter whether you sell or you don't sell, you just pay their... They look at as you are as if you are a number to them, like a subscription, a membership. That's what they're looking at. So, I would really appreciate your feedback. And... Give me some ideas. Shall I go back and open up a shop again and start filling up? Or shall I sell as a private seller for a few months, test it out? Because I'm testing a new kind of a niche now. Rather than selling all bits and pieces, I just like to sell strainers, basically. And see how I go along. So, once again, thank you so much for watching this video. And all of the other videos, hope you like them. Please make sure you click the like button, subscribe button, and hope I have given you a bit of info and thought about, you know, let me know what you think. So, once again, thank you so much.